Have you ever pondered the mystery of the dark side of the universe? The vast majority of the cosmos is made up of dark matter and dark energy, but what exactly are they? It's easy to feel small in the vastness of the universe, but what if I told you that there's a mysterious force lurking in the darkness, heating up the space between galaxies? Recent observations suggest that the intergalactic gas in our universe is a little hotter than it should be, and astrophysicists have proposed a radical solution. An exotic form of dark matter known as dark photons could be responsible for this strange phenomenon. In this video, I'll take you on a journey through the cosmos to explore the fascinating world of dark photons and how they could be changing our understanding of the universe forever. But before we continue, I would like to take a moment to express my gratitude towards our channel's supporters. Your generous support allows us to continue bringing you informative and quality content. We truly appreciate your contribution. Thank you so much for being a part of our community and for supporting our work. Once upon a time, a group of astronomers were studying the stars and galaxies in the universe. They were fascinated by the way galaxies move and rotate around each other, and they wanted to understand the forces that were driving these movements. They noticed something strange. The galaxies seemed to be moving faster than they should be, based on the amount of visible matter in the galaxy. This led them to a startling conclusion. There must be some unseen matter in the universe that was exerting a gravitational force on the galaxies, causing them to move faster. This mysterious substance became known as dark matter, and for many years, scientists tried to find ways to observe it directly. They built detectors deep underground and sent satellites into space, but no one could find any direct evidence of dark matter. Despite this, scientists were able to indirectly measure the effects of dark matter on the universe. They discovered that dark matter was present in vast amounts, making up around 85% of the matter in the universe. It was responsible for holding galaxies together and for shaping the large-scale structure of the universe. But what is dark matter made of? To this day, no one knows for sure. Some scientists believe it is made up of exotic particles that interact very weakly with regular matter, while others suggest it may be made up of primordial black holes or even tiny black strings. The mystery of dark matter continues to captivate scientists around the world, and they are still working to unravel its secrets. Recently, a team of astrophysicists used sophisticated computer simulations to propose a radical solution to a puzzling observation. The intergalactic gas in our universe was a little hotter than it should be, and something seemed to be heating it up that wasn't accounted for in our current astrophysical simulations. The solution the astrophysicists proposed was an exotic form of dark matter known as dark photons. These strange particles would be the carriers of a new fifth force of nature that normal matter does not experience. Occasionally, these dark photons can flip their identities to become regular photons, providing a source of heat. The team of astrophysicists pointed out that by using the Lyman Alpha Forest, a method of observing light from a distant bright object like a quasar, they could find such dark photons. When light passes through billions of light years of gas to reach us, it occasionally passes through a relatively dense clump of neutral hydrogen. Most of the light passes through unaffected, but a very specific wavelength of light gets absorbed, which corresponds to the energy difference needed to bump an electron from its first to its second energy level inside the hydrogen atoms. When astronomers look at the light coming from that object, it will look otherwise unremarkable except for a gap at the wavelength of that specific energy transition, known as the Lyman-alpha line. These gaps can also be used to measure the temperature of each gas cloud. If the individual molecules are moving, then the gap will widen because of the kinetic energy of those molecules. The hotter the gas, the more kinetic energy the molecules have, and the wider the gap. The team of astrophysicists found that the clouds of gas that scatter between galaxies are a little too hot, which was not predicted by computer simulations of the evolution of those gas clouds. One possible explanation for this discrepancy is the presence of dark photons in our universe, which would be a very hypothetical form of dark matter. The dark photons would still have a tiny bit of mass and could account for the dark matter. 
they could occasionally turn into a regular photon, heating things up. The researchers performed the first ever simulations of the evolution of the universe, including the effects of these sneaky, shape-shifting dark photons. They found that a particular combination of dark photon mass and the probability of changing into a regular photon could explain the heating discrepancy. Although this is not a slam-dunk case for the existence of dark photons, it is an intriguing clue that can be used as a springboard to continue exploring the viability of this exotic idea. Who knows what other mysteries this universe holds, waiting to be uncovered? And now, it's time to answer one of your questions. This comment comes from the Memes of Destruction, who brings up an intriguing point. They ask, what if our universe is older than 14 billion years? That's a great question. Thank you for bringing up this important point. The answer is that current estimates suggest that the age of the universe is around 13.8 billion years old. This estimation is based on a variety of scientific observations and measurements, including the cosmic microwave background radiation and the rate of expansion of the universe. However, it's important to keep in mind that our understanding of the universe is constantly evolving, and new discoveries could potentially change our understanding of the universe's age in the future. Thank you for your question. And that wraps up today's video. If you have any questions or thoughts you'd like to share, please don't hesitate to leave a comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to share it with family and friends who might be interested. Thank you for watching.